Good morning, welcome to weekly vlog 31. Can you believe we're on weekly vlog 31? Like, that's insane. I'm just packing because I'm staying at Daniel's tonight. I'm rushing because it's like half past nine, I need to leave. Black jeans. Um, I hope you enjoyed last week's vlog as much as you could. Uh, the end was edited in the car as you now know, and it was also completely exported in the car. I got home at midnight yesterday, so Saturday, so last Saturday for you, because I also, I like, I stopped off at the petrol station on the way back to actually, like, fill my whole tank. <laughs> that was, uh, stressful, bruh. It was an experience, and it was a funny experience that hopefully I will never experience again. <laughs> it was snowing, apparently, this morning. Daniel was on an open at work, so he was up at, like, 4am. Hang on, hang on. I need to talk to you, but I don't know where to put you. Let's put you down here. This is a nice angle. Um, he was up at like 4am and texted me and he was like, it's snowing so much. So I was like expecting there to be loads of snow when I got up. There's nothing. There's no snow. Like not even, doesn't even look like snow ever happened. I really want it to snow this year. It's just not going to, is it? It's just not going to snow. No. Oh, it's snowing now. Can you even see that? like a tiny 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 bit it's knowing a tiny tiny bit hello i just got home from daniel's i was going to film a video i don't know if you can hear this i don't know if the mic on this camera is going to pick it up but it's half term and there's children in like the estate next to us that are playing music ridiculously loud and i know my big mic will pick it up so i can't film a video so I've got to wait for it to stop before I can film a video, which is very annoying because I wanted to be produ productive and I get it done like, this morning. And now I can't. So I've decided I'm going to watch The Lion King and do a bit of spring cleaning in my room because I have so much junk that I need to get rid of. So that's my plan. That's how I'm going to spend my day instead until they turn their awful music off. It's so bad. <sighs> Can someone please tell me that I'm not going crazy and that in the DVD version of The Lion King, there's a song missing. Zazu's Morning Report song, I swear, in the original like videotape version of The Lion King, there was a song there about the morning report. Please, someone tell me that I'm not going mad and that they cut that song. <laughs> this is a new NYX lipstick that I got. I like it, but the darker colours are so much harder to put on. Like. I had to put like three layers on to make it like opaque. The colour was vintage retro, if you don't remember. And it smudged so easy. But the lines were really hard to get, like a straight line. But I really like the colour, so I think a bit of practice and we'll be good. Right now I'm fighting a nap, like I really want an afternoon nap. So bad and my bed looks so comfortable right now because I haven't made it. So it's still all like <laughs> comfy, squishy pillows. I need a nap. I will fight it. I will not nap. <laughs> Today has consisted of pretty much nothing that I planned to do apart from watch The Lion King and I had a spring clean out of my dressing table drawer but that is literally it. <laughs> That's all I've done today. I watched The Lion King then I watched a film called Elise which is about um, an asylum that was called Elise. That was good but strange at the same time and then now I've just been watching back to back <laughs> episodes of what is it ghost adventures I think yeah ghost adventures which is an American TV program about people who hunt ghosts basically um and I really liked it it's really good I'm enjoying it um and mum has just come in to say that we're having a roast dinner tonight which has made my day basically yeah, um, and I don't feel guilty about having a lazy day because I feel like I deserve it. <laughs> also, this lipstick. I don't like it as much as the nude one because it's like smudged. It's really hard to use. It was really hard to put on. Yeah, but I really like the colour, so I don't know. I'm sure I will make it work somehow, but right now I'm not. I'm not sure. <laughs>
literally have no idea what is going on with my hair right now on my face. I've woken up and I've got like weird kinks and stuff, but because I'm at Daniel's, I can't do anything about it. Um, sorry I didn't vlog anything yesterday. Yesterday was kind of an odd day for me. Happy Valentine's Day, by the way. My battery's flashing. Why does it always flash when I'm here? Um, yeah, it was kind of an odd day for me because it was the anniversary of... Oh my goodness, I need more hands. Hold on. Because it was the anniversary of my grandma's death. I was just a bit... Not really myself. Shh. And I just really didn't feel like picking up the camera, so I didn't, <laughs> basically. But I hope you all had a really cute Valentine's Day or a Galentine's Day if you're a single Pringle. And yeah, I need to go to work. Oh, my lashes look good today. At least that's one thing that went right. This is the thing with Daniel's house, is like the lighting's really bad in the morning, so I can't actually see what I'm doing to my face. And I always worry about my eyebrows when I'm at dance. Anyway, I need to go and I need to put something on my lips because they're so dry and sore. So I'll speak to you later. This is so cute. Mum texted me when I was on my way home today and she was like, look at the letter that's on your desk and you get in. And it's a little card from the vet and it says, we're sorry for the loss of your dear friend and companion. All our love, Veterinary Centre, Aquarius Veterinary Centre. How cute is that? That's so adorable. I'm guessing they do that for everyone that obviously loses a pet. <laughs> but I thought that was so cute. That's like a really thoughtful thing to do. So cute. By the way, I still haven't cleaned her cage out. It's still sat behind me. <laughs> Down there. And I got my flowers. Oh, you can't see them. Daniel got me flowers for, for Valentine's. Which is cute, cute. So I need to go put those in water actually, and I need to eat some dinner, and I need to take my makeup off, and I need to have a bath, and I just need to chill, and relax, and charge my battery, because it's still flashing. <laughs> oh, that car is just so cute. I have been world's worst vlogger this week. I swear, I think I'm getting worse, people. I think I'm getting worse. Um, I didn't vlog anything yesterday apart from like one clip. Um, it was kind of a bit of a whirlwind yesterday. I was at work and then mum met me after work and we went and had some dinner. We wanted to go to Wagamama's but it was the queue was ginormous. So we ended up going to ZZ's, which was really yummy. Yummy. Um, and then we went to see Sue Perkins who was on at the Corn Exchange in Cambridge and she is so funny it was such a good night I highly recommend if she comes anywhere near you on tour she's so funny hilarious really good like girls night out and yeah that was a really good night out it was nice to just have like a girly evening with my mum which doesn't happen very often but yeah that was really really good like really good and I'm back at work again today obviously I was actually meant to be off work yesterday but I had to swap my shift I'm now off tomorrow random Saturday so I think myself and Daniel are going to have some dinner or some food with Paul and Lucy who are like our double date couple friends because <laughs> we're really old I don't know where we're going yet it's kind of a tapas place has been recommended we can get some tapas and some wine which sounds really good we need to keep it cheap because like I am waiting for payday like I need payday now um, if you're wondering by the way, the lipstick I've got on is the Pink Fling from um, L'Oreal I think, the colour sensational one that I was obsessed about like a few months ago. I left it at work, it's literally just been sat at work in the off in the drawer under the till for like weeks and weeks. I forgot where it was and I found it again today because I forgot my other lipstick so put it back on and I like it again. It's such a nice colour. Um, but I also have a really painful ulcer right now in my mouth like on the side yeah it really hurts and I've got prawn cocktail Pringles yum and I'm finding them really hard to eat but I really want to eat them so yes worth the pain yeah I just wanted to kind of be like sorry I haven't shown you anything or vlogged anything for a little while it's kind of been a bit crazy this week I just feel like I haven't really stopped so yeah hopefully i will vlog a little bit of where we go tonight if we go to that tapas place i will show you it it looks really cute i've like searched it and seen some pictures and stuff and it looks absolutely adorable so there'll be some instagram pictures taken there if we go there because it just looks so good i failed again i didn't vlog anything i'm really sorry um we didn't go out in the end we stayed in and ate and paul cooked steak and mashed potato um 
And if you go onto my Instagram, you can see how Pinterest worthy he made our dinner. Like he put our mashed potato in massive coffee mugs and it looked so good and it was very pleasing for me and Lucy. It also tasted amazing, so it was worth staying in for. Oh, that's a good light. I look so rough right now. I need to have a shower. Um, I've been back home for a bit. We stayed over obviously because we were drinking last night. But I've just got home and yeah, I'm going to have a tidy up, have a shower. Then I want to film a video this afternoon. I want to be productive this afternoon. I haven't filmed a sit down video now for like two weeks. Um, and I need to get myself back into it. I feel like when I don't do it for a little while, I kind of lose the mojo for it. And the like, what's the word? I don't know, but basically I just can't bother. So I need to just make myself do it. So I'm going to film a video this afternoon once I'm all sorted. And yeah, my mouth, my ulcer is so sore today. Like so sore. It really hurts to kind of like talk and eat and stuff. Um, so I need to find some bongello and like shove some bongello on it. Oh, I haven't shown you the flowers that Dan got me yet, have I? They're right here. You would have seen them if you follow me on Instagram. How cute are they? They're so pretty. So pretty. Also, if you know my room, you may have noticed that I've changed the bits around. So this is now just got my flowers on. And then what was on there is up here. Um, just because I like wanted to make a bit more use of the space that I've got up here. Still everything the same in it. So I've got my palettes and stuff here. Lip products this side. Brushes this side with some random nail polish stuff. What is this? Molten brown. Ylang Ylang Nourishing Body Lotion. I haven't used that. Let's try that. But these are kind of like my go-to things that I've got in here. My Charlotte Tilbury's Max and stuff. I just wanted to kind of make a nice feature of my flowers. I think what I always want to do, I want to always have some flowers here. So I'm just going to make a conscious effort to make sure I keep flowers here. Because I just think flowers can like change the room and make the room just look brighter. Um, especially when you've got two water bottles in front of it and like a dirty blending sponge and some nail varnish. <laughs> just finishes it, don't you think? <laughs> hair shower, I am clean, my hair is washed. I used the um, purple shampoo that I got for the first time. My face always goes really red as well when I've had a shower, like my cheeks always go really red. Um, so we'll see how it goes. It feels really soft though. And I'm already in my pajama bottoms. Rocking it. <laughs> All about the comfort. Um, I don't know if I am going to film a video today. <laughs> I know. This is the problem with having, trying to run a YouTube channel and be organised with a YouTube channel and having a full time job because I literally get two days in a week to do like all of my filming and stuff because I get home from work so late. So, like, I have to hope that I'm in the right frame of mind and mood to film on that day. And it's so frustrating. And sometimes that kind of puts me out of the mood. Like, I read my faces. Um, and so I just, I just can't be bothered. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Uh, I think it's because I haven't, like, I haven't really got an idea as to what I want to film. And if I've got, like, an idea as to what I want to film, I'm more excited to film it. Whereas if I'm kind of like, oh, I could film this, then I don't get very excited and I don't really want to film it. I feel like I'm talking really weird. <laughs> it hurts, people, it hurts. I'm going to leave my hair to dry naturally, I think, because I haven't done it in a while. Since I've had it cut, actually, I've never let it dry naturally. So bad, considering I never used to use, like, heat on it at all. And then I'll style it tomorrow morning before I go to work instead, just to give it a bit of a break. And a breather. I thought I'd super quickly in a really weird angly type thing show you my natural hair. Like this is why I don't leave it natural because it just can't decide what it wants to do. It can't decide if it's wavy, if it's straight. It also looks like way thinner when it's natural as well. So I just can't leave it. That's why if I don't use heat I do like that twist thing that I used to do all the time and not wear French braid it, that sort of thing. And um, recently I've been using heat a lot more. Which is why I left it to dry naturally today because... It's not gonna do it any good if I keep using heat on it. But yeah, I just thought I'd um, show you it. I hate it, I don't like my natural hair. To be honest though, who's ever happy with their hair? There's always something that you don't like. I'm pretty much up to date with the vlog edit. It's really short. I'm really sorry that it's so short. 
Uh, I've really failed this week at vlogging. I just didn't pick the camera up. There's so many times I'm looking back at my week and I'm like, why didn't I vlog that? Uh, so apologies, but I'm going to up my game next week and next week's vlog is going to be good. I promise. I don't know how, but it's going to be good. I'm going to make it a good vlog for your eyes to enjoy. <laughs> decided I need ice cream so I'm gonna have a look see if there's still any left from the three tubs that Chris got the other day <laughs> there might not be but hopefully there will be something um also there's something wrong with my memory card yes um there's ice cream I just took it out and like put it back in and it said there was an error so I took it out again put it back in and it was fine so I'm like I don't know what's wrong with you what ice cream fish food I'm gonna have fish food really fancy some ice cream also this is gonna sound really odd hang on but when i've got an ulcer it like makes my tongue feel really swollen so i feel like i can't talk properly and i like bite the sides of it and it's just really uncomfortable so that's another reason why i want ice cream because i think it will make that feel a bit better oh, if i'm very red in here i need a spoon spoon yay i can eat my ice cream also i've just seen that the second episode of more side is on um, I play so while I upload the vlog I'm going to watch that and eat some ice cream so I'm gonna end the vlog now again really sorry it was a really short crappy vlog um, hopefully you still enjoyed it give it a thumbs up if you did let me know um, hopefully next week is going to be much better a bit more exciting um, I've got an exciting day with Chris actually on Thursday so watch next week to find out what that is and yeah I'll see you next week bye